Wilmington family is grieving tonight after a relative is struck and killed by two vehicles over the weekend. The woman was killed as she walked across Naaman's Road in Claymont over the weekend. One of the drivers who hit her left before police arrived. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo is in Claymont with more. Matt. Just police tell us they're looking for a black vehicle with left front end damage to it and a missing left mirror after that woman was struck and killed here in Claymont. It's horrible. It's sad because it's someone's life that is taken. Delaware State Police blocked off this intersection here at Naaman's and Marsh Roads in Claymont Saturday night after troopers say a 40 year old Wilmington woman was hit and killed. Police tell us she was walking across Naaman's Road when a driver struck her, throwing her body into the left turn lane. Troopers then say the driver took off, leaving her body in the road when a second driver also hit her. That second driver, though, stopped and called 911. Today, state police are still investigating and wouldn't say if speed was a factor in the hit and run, but people who live and work nearby say this intersection is notorious for drivers traveling above the 50 mile per hour speed limit. People do speed on this road a lot. They would need to slow down and go the speed limit. Police also didn't make clear if the woman who was killed was in the crosswalk, but from above, Chopper 3 also shows the challenges trying to cross this busy five lane intersection. Some people try to avoid crossing the road altogether. It's scary because you don't know if you're going to get hit. You got to also make sure that you're just being cautious and looking both ways because people sometimes might not be looking. And again, troopers tell us they're looking for a black vehicle with heavy front end damage to the left side of it and also a left missing mirror. Live in Claymont, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Matt, thank you.